hi guys welcome to this video in this video i'm gonna show you how to use csrf token while submitting your form in ajax so as you guys know whenever you're submitting your form using a post method you must always add your csrf token to prevent you from the csrf attack so the first thing you need to do while submitting your form in Ajax, you must make sure that you have the CSRF token included in your form. So basically, yeah, I have this form which has three fields: um, the name, the email, and the and the bio, and also the submit. So after having those fields, uh, you must include this CSRF token right here before you can apply it in your Ajax. So now that I have that CSRF token there, I'm going to scroll down. After passing all the values of the form, I also need to pass the value of the CSRF token. For me to do that, I'm going to say CSRF middleware token. I'm going to put a column and then a dollar sign. After doing that, I'm going to open a bracket and say input square bracket name should be csrf token middle where token then i'm going to close the square bracket and then after that i'm going to say dot val so this okay so this is what we need to add CSRF token while passing the form. So now that I have this, if I go test out my form, I'm gonna see that my form is gonna be submitted to my database. So let me show you guys. Um, in this, my Django project, I have a model which is profile. It takes a name, email, and bio. So this is the model right here in profile. As you guys can see, I have six objects right here in this model. So let me refresh this page, open the inspect element, and then make sure that it's network. So when I come here to create a new one, I'm going to do something like, let me just say name. Let me just put in any field here, name at gmail.com and the buyer say I am name. So now when I click on submit, you guys can see that we we'll see something like create here which says the status code says okay so if i scroll down to the bottom you can see that it passes those fields which is name the name i inputted email name at gmail.com bio i am name and after inputting all those it automatically generated a csrf token to prevent us from csrf attacks now this is very important while posting a form now if I come back here I'm gonna see that one new object has been asked has been added so if I come here I'll see name name at gmail come I am name so that's how to use some um, CSRF token in your post form using Ajax so if I come here and then let me see I remove this CSRF token let me scroll to the right and remove this field right here CSRF token even if I have the CSRF token written here in my form, that's not enough while using Ajax. So let me save it and then come back and refresh. So now if I try to input a new field right here, just input to something random then add gmail.com and then the bio, I'm just putting something random. So now if I click on submit, you see that it gives me an error. Right here, it says 403 forbidden. And that's because if I scroll down here, there is no CSRF token which has been generated. Now this is very important anytime we are using a post method. You can see that the method is post. But mind you, if we are using a get method, we don't need to add CSRF token because obviously all the values are being passed in our URLs. But post method is to secure the data which is being passed in a form. That's why we use our CSRF token. Now, I hope you guys understood what we did right here in this video. 
if you did please don't forget to smash the like button and please subscribe and press the bell notification button so you get notified when i drop new videos having that said thank you for watching and bye for now